able the weekend test Faye has been making waves with his major acting role in HBO's newly released series The Idol, but his journey from music to acting wasn't entirely smooth. Stay tuned to find out the bizarre reason why The Weeknd lost his voice after filming The Idol. It's no secret that every actor has a unique method of acting. For some actors, it's as simple as doing their job. For others, however, the process is a bit more complex and involves multiple techniques. And then, there's a third kind of actor, the one who unknowingly gets too engrossed in their role and is unable to detach themselves from their character. That seems like what happened to The Weeknd while filming his new HBO series The Idol. The drama series premiered at the Cannes Film Festival in May before getting a highly anticipated release on June 4th. It stars Lily Rose Depp as Jocelyn, a rising pop star who starts a romance with an enigmatic Los Angeles club owner, self-help guru, and modern-day cult leader Tedros, played by The Weeknd. The Idol was first announced in 2021, with The Weeknd stating that he would be creating, executive producing, and co-writing the drama series. The Blinding Light singer closely worked on the project with Euphoria creator Sam Levinson, who also directed The Idol. The role of Tedros may have taken Abel Tisfaye's acting career one step ahead, but it wasn't an easy feat for the Canadian artist. In a recent interview, he opened up about the challenges of filming The Idol and how it impacted his music career. Turns out, The Weeknd got so immersed in his character that it eventually resulted in a terrifying moment where he lost his voice during a September 2022 concert in LA. I don't know what just happened, but I lost my voice, he informed the crowd from the stage. This is killing me, I don't want to stop the show, but I can't give you the concert I want to give you right now. I'm gonna make sure everybody's good. You'll get your money back, I'll do a show real soon for you guys. But I wanted to come out and personally apologize. Referring to this incident, The Weeknd revealed during his interview that playing Tedros may have been the reason behind his lost voice. I had to take off The Weeknd outfit, put on Tedros wig, shoot with Jocelyn, and then go back to being The Weeknd, the singer explained. It was tough to go from one head to another. Then, after the concert, I lost my voice. No voice came out at all. That's never happened before. The Starboy singer added, My theory is that I forgot how to sing because I was playing Tedros, a character who doesn't know how to sing. I may be looking too deeply into this, but it was terrifying. According to The Weeknd, playing Tedros' character changed something in him, something he didn't realize before. As The Weeknd, I've never skipped a concert. He admitted, I performed with the flu. I'll die on that stage, but there was something very complicated going on with my mind at that moment. During the same interview, Tesfaye also opened up about juggling acting and music. I'm going through a cathartic path right now, he said. It's getting to a place and a time where I'm getting ready to close the weekend chapter. I'll still make music, maybe as evil, maybe as the weekend, but I still want to kill the weekend, and I will eventually. I'm definitely trying to shed that skin and be reborn. Abel further revealed that he's currently working on his final album, after which he'll be retiring his world-famous stage name. The album I'm working on now is probably my last hurrah as The Weeknd, he explained. This is something that I have to do. As The Weeknd, I've said everything I can say. Looking back at his journey and remarkable music career, Abel talked about his current artistic process and why music isn't his only focus anymore. Film and TV is a new creative muscle for me, he said. I don't release my music until I think it's great. Why would this be any different? I like when all the odds are against me, he said. I've always been an underdog. In the beginning, the music business wasn't easy. I had to fight to get to the top of the mountain. The Idol isn't able to spy his first acting venture, and it certainly won't be his last. The Grammy-winning singer made his acting debut back in 2019 for the Netflix thriller Uncut Gems. He appeared as himself and made a memorable cameo alongside Adam Sandler and Julia Fox. As for his upcoming acting projects, The Weeknd is set to make his feature film debut alongside Wednesday star Jenna Ortega. In February 2023, multiple outlets confirmed that the Savior Tear singer will appear on the big screen not only as a lead actor, but also as a producer, writer, and director. The film is currently untitled, and no further details have been revealed as of yet. 
but we do know that Oscar nominee and BAFTA winner Barry Cogan will also join the cast. That's it for today's video, guys. So what do you think about The weekend's role in The Idol and his upcoming acting projects? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below, and we'll see you again in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.